So welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. Another episode today, and we got some big matches. Some whoppers, folks. We've got Newcastle United and Arsenal. Both are Old Trafford. One in the Premier League, one in the FA Cup. So if you haven't seen the last episode, check it out. Crazy games, as always. Uh, remember, we have updated the gameplay. I honestly think, though, like if... You know, talking about the stopping, and the, I didn't see anywhere near as much of the stop and start animations in the last episode. I do believe it's because we've got that, you know, the dynamic, um, the dynamic difficulty enabled. So check that out. There it is. You got to make sure if you are playing football life, just put it on zero or just leave it zero zero. You don't need to change anything. That basically just makes it, you know, even across the board. Well, that's what it's meant to do. Now, if you use this on lower difficulties, I don't know how well it's going to work. Superstar, probably be all right. I don't know about top player, etc. but there we go. So today, though, we are taking on Newcastle. We are going to play the exact same way we did in the last game. I thought once we fixed the problems, it worked. And um, basically, we, we're going to play possession, maintaining the support range. I normally, I like to have them a little bit... Um, closer together. I don't know about today, though. Maybe we should stretch Newcastle. Let's play a little bit... Yeah, a little bit more stretch. And also, defensive line, I've gone a little bit higher. That's what I did in the last match, because I was playing too... I just felt like I was playing too deep. Too deep. And I know we're playing Newcastle. They're going to have more pace. But still, we'll play a little bit more compact as well. And then we kind of just go from there. We're going to try as well. I'm going to man mark their wingers. All right? Dallow's going to be on Jolington. And Martinez is going to be in Gordon. Let's try that out. And that's the lineup, by the way. The reason we're doing this is, as you can see, Varane's down. Uh, Grimaldo's down. So I'm going to... This is a big gamble. It's a big gamble. I don't know how it's going to go, folks. Yes, we try it for the team. But I don't know. Because Kasunu and Schlitterbeck are both extra front men. Now, he is left footed, um, Schlitterbeck, and Kasuni's right footed, so that's perfectly fine. And we're going to start Martinez there as a left back. I know he's not a left back, but we're going to play him there anyway. Do you think, and let me know in the comments, we should change Schlitterbeck to possibly uh, build up? I do like Kasunu as just, he's been fantastic so far, so I think just leave him alone. But maybe we want another build up, or we can just leave it. Let me know about that. Casemiro comes in as always with Mainu. I think he was great in the last game, along with Bruno. And then we've got Ganacho buzzing today, Han Hoyland's buzzing, uh, and Elise, I think he did the part as well. So that's what we're going for. Okay, and there was Newcastle. So anyway, let's dive into the action <sighs> as we take on Newcastle. Actually, before we do that, where are they in the table? There they are, 11th. 33 points, we have 42. So they haven't had the best season this season. And they want to try and close the gap. But we've got to win because we want to extend that gap and close the gap on fourth. Anyway, I will see you guys there as we dive into another match. I don't know why I sound Italiano, but I'll see you in the match. So we're back. Back where we belong, at the home of Old Trafford. A big game today. Man United, Newcastle, United. Uh, in the Barclays Premier League. I don't even know what match day we're on, but you guys will know. But we're winding it down. And next up, folks, the big match. FA Cup quarterfinal against the Gunners. So they will be uh, showing up at Old Trafford within the next few days. But we got to make sure we play well today. We had a terrible start in the last few matches. We're still trying to find the tactical prowess. Not really, but you know what I mean. Trying to find the uh, tactical masterclass for this team. And just like Man United in real life, it's not going to suddenly happen. It's going to take a lot of time for things to think to click and gel. So, anyway, here is Martinez. Starts again with uh, the new boy at the back, Schlitterbeck. He does seem a little bit slow, I will admit. When you compare him to Kasunu, Kasunu is much quicker on the ball. Schlitterbeck, sometimes I feel like he's waiting for an extra business day. Just get a move on me. Nice right, Man United start off with uh, just a bit of uh, bit of possession here. That's fine. Take your time, lads. You see Newcastle just pressing. Casemiro taking far too long, mate. And uh, that's why. Come on, let's wake up, please. Izek dropped into the hole. 
And uh, it's a tasty looking ball. Well done, Unana there. Good claim by the keeper. Casemiro. Kasuna. But the touch on. Dallo. We'll play this one two intricate football here. Elise. The switch is on. It's not a bad ball. In fact, it's a lovely pass. Alejandro Ganacho now looking for Martinez. Great play. Oh, I'll tell you what, that's filthy. And how's the ball in? Rasmus is there. <laughs> We're dreaming. We're dreaming there. Look at this play from Martinez. Just flick this round the defender. Boop. And then see, it's just so fluid. I love it. Honestly, this is it, folks. This is the gameplay you want. You know, any time you're playing the AI and everything just works and you just don't feel like you're at a disadvantage, that's the joys of it. I thought you might pass that. Anyway, here's Gumaraish. Gumaraish. Livramento. Up against Bruno now. Gumaraish. Wants to play it through. Oh, it's nice play. Oh, well done, Dallo. Remember, we are man marking. I don't know how well it's going to work. We're going to have to figure that out. Uh, Elise, careful. That's a, that's a good read there from Izek. Kasunu. But yeah, having, you know, the 4-3-3 is just a different style, isn't it? It's it's giving you that cover down the flanks, which you don't normally get with that four, you know, with the three at the back. So, we're you know, we are trying something different. Oh, Bruno, unlucky. Gordon now trying to flick it on. Izek. That's a poor pass from him. Hoyland, let it run. There you go. That was smart play. Uh, Mainu. And Mainu, you know, getting a lot of movement from the young boy. Look in the part. Casemiro. No, Cassie. Cassie, Cassie. That's not what we wanted you to do there. Now Newcastle got a chance to break. And it's Gordon. Oh, he managed to get it out wide, fortunately, there. Jolington. Closed down by Dallo. Target fires in a good ball. Is that trying to get up? Casemiro with a good header. Gumaraish. Closed down quickly by Mainu. Long staff. It's a good play this from Newcastle, though. Matt Target. Which way you want to go, son? Long staff. If we win this, we've got a chance to counter here. Gumaraj lost it. Oh, he's done well. Fires it high. And that should be Unana's all day. Bruno. Half a flick on. And it's a good ball. And oh, lay it over the top, Elise. Oh, we should have laid it over the top. We would have been in. Livramento does get it in again. Casemiro get it out. Well done. Hoyland trying to get something on it. Bruno couldn't get there. Now suddenly Newcastle starting to get into this game. More and more back passes. A good ball. That's a great goal. <sighs> That's a good goal. I'll give him credit to that. Maybe the man. I don't know. It take it off. I think doing the man marking is not as smart. Because all that's happening is they're more focused. Obviously with those players. It's going to open up the wings a little bit more. And look how much look how much space he has on the left hand side. It's smart play. It's a wonderful pass. The touch is beautiful and the finish is ridiculous. <sighs> you live and learn. And that's the threat. That's the threat Newcastle will always have. They've got quality. And apparently they can finish pretty decently too as well. Alright. So, Man United a goal down. It's happening all too much for them. But yeah, we've turned off the man marking now. Forget it. So uh, we should be okay. Well, hopefully. So Casemiro. Martinez. Let's just work this round out, out down the flanks. Ganacho, double touch. Back heel, lovely. Martinez, high looper. Hoyland! Wasn't far away. And I know that's maybe where... Oh, Maynou. Maybe that's where Skamaka would be more useful. But, you know, would you play Skamaka over Hoyland? No, you just wouldn't. You know, Hoyland's still going to grow. Still going to still going to evolve. Good play, lads. Much better football, though, isn't it? Mainu is just becoming a monster. Really is. Oh, that's a pathetic pass. Gimaraish, Gordon. Gets it out wide. Martinez trying to stay with him, but uh, gets the face in the way, and that works. Casemiro, no, you, Casemiro, you're not prime Mar Maradona, mate. You can't be doing that there. And yeah, never gonna, never gonna trouble the goalie from that kind of position. But yeah, Casemiro trying to do Mr. Twiddle. No, 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 no. We don't dribble in there, Casemiro. 
<sighs> Luckily, Kasunu closed him down. Going the other way now. See you later. Beautiful Ganache. That's what I do love. Alejandro. Deflection. <sighs> Could have gone anywhere. Back to uh, Lascelles as we have crossed the 38-minute mark here at Old Trafford. Man United trail by a goal to nil. Wonderful finish from Matt Target. Is uh, what separates the two teams here. Mainu. Hoyland. Elise. He's done well. Dallo. Uh, get up. Get up, Dallo. It's all right. It's all right. Keep the pressure on. Keep working it. Probably. Uh, the thing is, I do. Oh, it's just frustrating because I don't know. Oh, that's a good bit of play. Oh, is it? Yep. Good play from Target. Won the ball comfortably. And Jolington now back to uh, Tenali. Final three minutes to play till half time. Livramento. I think, mate. I mean, we're not playing Rashford, are we? Maybe we do need to start putting him on. But you know what? It's, it's, you know, it's a trial time now, isn't it? It's all about trying to get a feeler for these players. <laughs> Look at that, through the old pie hole. And ultimately, see which players are worth playing. You know, you work for your place. Simple as that. And there's half time. So, a lot to do. A lot to do. Credit to Newcastle. I say, the goal was fabulous. They worked it to a T, but that man marking really messed us up. We won't be doing that again. The only time I would say do man marking is three at the back and you want to put like the middle centre mid centre back, the middle one, then he can sit on a centre forward. But other than that, it's kind of a waste. And it sometimes it's just detrimental to the team. So anyway, I don't know. Let's see. See in the second half. So away we go for another 45. Ten Hag is... Just said to the team, look, we're going to play more counter-attacking. Yes, one, two touch footballs from back to front. Very tight, very sexy. That's the uh, game plan for Ten Hag. Could you imagine if that was his team talk? I want you to play the sexy footballs, please. There's uh, Elise looking for Bruno. We're going to flick that. It's a lovely touch. Oh, nearly found Alejandro Ganacho there. But yeah, we're really going to counter this half. We're going to play some... Some football, Elise, lovely. Raf mugged him off. Can't do that now. Can't do that. You get a yellow. But you saw that lovely play from Elise. Elbow to the face. And more importantly, a real big chance here from this position. Look at this. Bang. See you later. And then, yeah, just clotheslined him. Filthy bird. Absolutely filthy. All right. Well, we can certainly try out the free kicks. That'd probably be exactly the same as before, but uh, let's give this a bash. It's going to be Bruno Fernandez, and it's over the bar. Yeah, a little bit of a late reaction, Ten Hag. Shot that a minute ago, but yeah, just a little bit too much elevation. Where is Elise? He's getting, he's still, you know, look, Elise is slowly getting into it, though, isn't he? I think you can say that. There's Livramento. Stay with him. Please don't dive in. We know that penalties can be given very easily on this game. And uh, wide of the mark. But yeah, you just you, this this predicament here. You don't. Well, you're just making a wall. You're building that wall, just trying to block it. Well, I do feel though, and maybe a little bit of time. We we will bring on Skamaka. Um, just to. Give us that little extra, possibly. Here is Martinez. Up the line. Lovely ball. Ganacho. This is it. Lovely back ball. Once again, is Maino. And there's the block. We'll let that roll out. It's going to be a corner. The thing is, though, today, like, all the players are up for it. Ganacho, Elise, Hoyland. I don't really want to take him off. But I do kind of miss Gamaka's heading. But we'll give it a little bit more time. And then... Uh, yeah, we'll see what we can do. Right, let's just go for a train here. Fire this in with Bruno. And maybe someone might win the header. Ganacho off the line. Shoot the ball. Oh, my God. Talk about Newcastle being complacent. Sitting on the line. Ganacho, how close was that? From the equaliser. Menu through the legs. Ganacho. 
Oh, too much, mate. Too much. Now a chance here for Newcastle. Longstaff plays it through the middle. I am worried about the brakes. Well done, Schlitterbeck. Think that one over the top. Martinez. Go all the way round here to uh, Diego Dallo. Main it. Elise. Already shown you what he can do today with his feet. Dallo. Careful. Lovely. Mainu. Elise again. Fire it. Loop it. Why are we trying to loop it though? Bruno. Finish. Hit anyone but the keeper, please. Right, a lot of changes, folks. We're, we're mixing things up here. Skamaka is coming on. We're going three at the back. Because Harry Maguire is coming on. And, uh, yeah, three at the back here. And we bend this one right off the post. Make this 1-1. One, one, then we go for the finish. Here we go. It's going to be Bruno Fernandes! Ah, so close, but a good save from the keeper. But we do have a chance here now. Skamaka is in. And we've got, we've got so many players up. We're going to six-yard box this like you wouldn't believe. And uh, honestly, let's get Schlitterbeck to win this header. Right, come on. Someone's got to get in there. Flick it. That's our ball. What a waste. What a waste of a corner that was. So there's your possession. 53 for Manchester United. Like I said, we got better possession today. That's a good header. Oh, that's not a good ball. Um, but yeah, we've had better possession. We just find ourselves... A goal down here. Gumaraish. Up against Kasunu here. Target. Casemiro. Get in there. Well done, Casemiro. Stay on him again. Target once more. Wants to whip it. Kasunu's not having any of it. Fantastic play. And at least just not coming to the ball when you want him to. And that's a lovely pass. Wilson! <laughs> oh, ridiculous. Right, well, this is going to be a long... I don't even know what I'm going to say. It's going to be a long, hard-fought rest of the season. I mean, look, we messed ourselves up because we were a goal down and we're pushing for it. I've had to go three at the back again. So, look, Schlitterbeck is playing him on side and he's, he's taking it well. All right, final few changes. We'll bring on Marcus Rashford and... Mason Mount and I've, it's really I mean I, I tell you what Ten Hag he's got his work cut out I mean we've got a decent sized squad here it's hard work trying to you know which players you want to play who don't you want to play you know Mason Mount not really probably getting enough playing time but it's just you know it's not working Skamaka I mean has he done a whole lot for us since we bought him no he hasn't but am I playing him properly probably not you know so these are things that are going to take a lot of time Let's not concede another one, please. Four minutes of stoppage time here. That's good play. Fired in. Bruno's there. Gets it out. Elise looking for Hoyland. I mean, if, if we get some sort of a consolation goal, would be nice. If we could get Skamaka on the scoring sheet, that would be nice too. Rashford. It's not a foul ref. I, I, see, this is what I mean. This referee today, absolute moron. Like, the referees we've had in the last few matches were perfectly fine. Today... I feel like he's just been given fouls for the sake of it. Frustrations. That's all coming out, folks. It's all coming out. There's nothing wrong with that. Pathetic ref. But, you know, you, you win some, you lose some. It's going to be the Murph to take the free kick. Big deflection. You know, I should claim that. No, he wants to punch it for some reason. It comes all the way back to Murphy. Schlitterbeck's there. Skamaka. And there's your full-time whistle, folks. If it's away from home, okay, you know, I can accept that. But we are we are losing at home at the moment. We we are we can't we lost to Luton 3-1 at home. We've now lost to Newcastle 2-0 at home. This can't happen. And we've got Arsenal next. This FA Cup match is gonna be mad because it's gonna be more crazier than ever. But look at it. Eight attempts to six. Like we created. We had chances, we had possession. Just rubbish. And apparently a lot of goalies now are going to get tens if they make saves. There it is again. And a clean sheet. There we go. Callum Wilson got an eight. Target got an 8.5. Right, let's have a look at the other results. All right, how are we looking? Nottingham Forest lost to Brentford. Uh, Chelsea beat Luton at this rate. Chelsea are going to catch us up. West Ham did lose, though. That helps us out. 
Uh, Crystal Palace 2 0 win there. Brighton beat Liverpool 4 0. Blimey. Wolves did draw. Man City lost to Spurs. Uh, Spurs are going to win this league. That's nuts. Uh, Aston Villa won. Didn't want to see that. And Arsenal won as well against Everton. So we have problems now. I mean, not only are we, well, we're still eight points behind City because they lost, but we're only a point ahead of Brighton, who are now ninth. Oh, dear. And bottom of the table, Luton, Crystal Palace, Brentford. But yeah, Tottenham, Arsenal now up to second. And Liverpool pushed down into third place. And guess who we have next, folks? That's right. It is Arsenal. It is the FA Cup. It's the quarterfinals. And it could be mad. It will be mad. There's be a lot of back and forth action between this. Liverpool have lost some momentum. Uh, but we don't look in the best form either. We need to grab a win in our next game to give us a lift for the derby. Yes, I know, because I am running the team. And I show the result, okay? Gosh. Uh, you notice now that uh, that Ten Hag doesn't say please anymore. Said, when he first came to England, he'd be like, please. And then he realized that that's not really the correct verbiage over here, over in England, you know? You say thank you. So now he says, yes, thank you, please. <laughs> All right, FA Cup. Let's sort this out. Let's figure it out. <laughs> I was going to cough. Do we want to go 4-3-3 again? Wow, everyone's up for it. That's good news. I feel like we have to match Arsenal. I feel like if we don't play four at the back today, we're going to have a problem with um, Martinelli and Saka. So, yeah, we'll probably go 4-3-3. Let me pick a lineup and return. All right, folks, so today, big change at the back. Uh, Bayern D is going to start because Unana is on the old 25%. It's not good enough. So we're going to start buying deer. I'm hoping his hands are good. Sometimes the guy just forgets he has hands. Uh, but we're going to bring back Grimaldo uh, as the left back today. We're going to go Varane and Kasunu. I mean, it's a big selection. Do we go Martinez? Do we go Varane? Or do we go Schlutterbeck? Do we go Maguire? I'm really liking Kasunu. I think he's phenomenal from what we've had so far. Um, and I think Varane will be better suited today um, with Gabriel Azuz, so we're going to try him. Schlutterbeck is all right. I'm still getting a flavor for him, but he's very slow on the ball. You know, sometimes he takes a little bit too long. Dallo will be obviously the right back. We're going to still go for that midfield. I don't think the midfield's been a problem. I don't know about... I mean, Casemiro might be better suited as a destroyer as opposed to an anchor man in this team. So maybe we could try and buy a destroyer. Could always change him. But these two have been okay. And then we're going to go Rashford today. We haven't played him enough. We're going to start pure pace. Rashford, Hoyland, Ganacho. Let's see what we do. And uh, yeah, as I said, a lot of players are up for it. It's really hard to choose the best players to choose. You know, we could play Amrabat. We could play Mason Mount, uh, McTominay even. We could play Elise. He's been playing all right. Dallo, I mean Diallo, Skamaka. But this is what we're going to go for. So anyway, there's a look at Arsenal. They're going to have pace. They're going to press. We know this game is going to be ridiculously open because it is an FA Cup match, and that's how things go. So, without further ado, yeah, look, they've got nice little scoreboards. Players to watch. Well, Varane wouldn't really be a player to watch. I mean, Gabriel Jesus, maybe. Anyway, I will see you guys there. FA Cup quarterfinals. Can we do what Man United have done in real life, get to the semifinals of the FA Cup? We're about to find out, lads. Let's do it. So we are live on BBC, folks, for this match between Manchester United and Arsenal. It's a belter. It's probably the biggest tie of the round. I don't even know who's playing elsewhere in the competition. But Man United will figure that out after this game. Big news. Bayern Deer starts. Unana drop for this one. But yeah, it's going to be an attacking match. Both teams... 4-3-3, both teams full of pace, full of counter-attacking qualities. We're going to start playing with possession, and then if, if needed, we'll change to counter. I just, I don't want to go counter to start with, and then it all goes mental, and we're leaving holes all over the place. So, without further ado, the referee blows Man United from your left to right in their red strip, Arsenal right to left, wearing their away third kit today, the old greenie. 
But uh, yeah, Varane is back in the lineup today with Kasunu. A lot of rotation in this Manchester United team now. Ganacho trying to do some trickery. Oh, nearly got it and lost it. And here comes Smith Rowe. Ben White now against Grimaldo. Bukayo Saka has been an influential player for Arsenal, hasn't he? What a young lad he is. What a talent. Ben White again does deliver in a really good ball. That actually comes off Dallo. I didn't fix the nets for the... I don't know why the Man United nets go mental. It's weird. I don't know. Got to get in there and play around with the server. Anyway, Arsenal with a chance for the corner. Kasuna gets it away. Maynou trying to get there. Man United unable to make the challenge. And Arsenal with the first attempt of the game from Smith Rowe. Yeah, just couldn't quite get the bearings right on that one. It wasn't that close, mate. Odegaard. Stay with him. Offside. Oh, no. Martinelli. Come on. I'll tell you what, that FA Cup handicap, I'm telling you, it's still there. The players don't want to react to you. But, yeah, Martinelli here just wanted to walk it in, didn't he? Oh yeah, Kasunu again. The guy's always in the way. Go on, let's see. He can still stick a foot in, lads. He's still get involved. Arsenal are vulnerable here. They're pushing a lot of players forward. Ben White. That's a, that's a long one. Saka, like instant control. And now he wants to get it on that left foot. And he has found uh, Jesus. Once again, Kasunu, man. He's always there. Zinchenko. Odegaard looking for the switch. <laughs> It's just mad how, how well they ping this around. It's just... It's hard work. Right, we have got a chance to break. Ganacho. Right, let's, let's calm it. Let's calm it, please. Grimaldo. Just get control of this game. Pursue it. Dallo. Maynard, you want it? Let's get that one up the line to Rashi. He's got no one on. He's got no... Get away from me. Well done, Rashford. But at least you can hold players off. Do you know what I mean? Stats mean something, at least. All right, here we go. This is our first real chance. Ben White's been done for pace. Near post. Oh, ay, 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 ay. Hoyland, what's happened in there? Is he taking him out, ref? Have a word. Well, look at this. Space for Bruno. Grimaldi. No, Grimaldi. That's all right. You've done brilliant. Get off him! Oh, Saka just wouldn't leave him alone. Got a proper FA Cup tie here, folks. This is going to be a hard-fought match. Here comes Smith Rowe now. Ben White. Inside, Jorginho. Swings it inside. Odegaard. Jesus. Well done, Kasunu. Did just enough to put him off. We'll just keep launching these throws out and ultimately try and break when we can this is not a game about possession I'll tell you that much no nope. today's just about breaking and trying to score Saka watch the switch there it is should be okay for Varane <sighs> by a deer just madness Bruno says he'll take it on a plate oh nah Bruni well that's a, a ridiculous pass and a silly pass and now Man United will break Come on, Alejandro Ganacho. What does he do? Lays it back and it comes off my own player. Unbelievable. Well, I don't want to pull anyone out, so we're going to stay with the runner here with uh, Jesus. Smith Rowe wants to swing it around the other way. Jorginho. Saka. I mean, we could try a 4 3, a 3 4 3, you know? I don't know. Because there are times when, yeah, I do miss having that two up top. But in a game like this today, where we can't even get the ball out, having two up top means absolutely nothing. Bruno, how's the ball? It's not bad. It's not bad. And Rashford, are you there? Are you there? No, you're not. Because Ramsdale is. Credit to him there. He did well. Uh, Grimaldo, what on earth was that? New move. New move unlocked. Well done, Bruno. That's beautiful. Ben White up his backside now. Feeds it up the line, looking for the Hoyland. Up against Saliba. Oh, nearly got there as well. 
got uh, no time. It's half time. Have we had a shot? I don't think so. Arsenal been all over us. Oh, it's an FA Cup match. All right, folks. Difficult. Zero attempts for us. Four for Arsenal. Oh, dear, oh dear. Okay. Let's tactically fix this. I'll see you in the second half. So away we go. Second half. We've gone for counter. That's it. Ten Hag said, yes, it's time to play the counter-attacking football of the team. We are Manchester United. Yeah, this is what we do. So yeah, we're going to outmuster Arsenal in this second half here. Here's Martinelli. Odegaard. And say, so I don't care about them having possession. It means uh, we just have to make sure we can defend in numbers when needed. Oh, blind dear. Take your time. No need to rush. I mean, we could play, you know, attacking fullbacks is an option. But um, if we do that, I'm very, very worried about how vulnerable we're going to be. Here's Saka. There you go, Grimaldo. See? That's better, son. Casemiro, are you coming to it? No, you're not. Right. Ganacho through the legs. Bruno. Let's get this round the other way. No, Kasunu, don't. I didn't really want you to make that run, but he said he's going to do it anyway. Here comes Rashford now. Maynou. Leads it back to him. Maynou, keep going. There you go. It's much better football. Edge of the box stuff this. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, see? That's better. That's what we're looking for. You know? Back from front. Have a chance. Unlucky. Anyway, change it. Ben White off. Fabio Vieira on. That's an interesting change. Is he going to play right back? How's that work? Cross the hour mark here. Everything on the line. A chance to get into the semi-final of the FA Cup. Kasunu's done well. Bruno. Casemiro finding Dallo. Mainu. Hoyland, where are you going? Dallo, you want it? Give it to Dallo. Lovely! Squared it! Oh, just... That's good movement, though. I think we are going to have to play counter-attack. There's just so much more movement from the players... You know, because that's the way Man United play. I mean, it really is. Oh, that's unlucky. And this second half now, now we switch to counter-attack. I don't know why Fabio Vieira is playing as a right-back, but that's, you know, Arteta's decision. Here is Vieira, and that is an absolute woeful pass. And that's an no woeful pass from Bruno. Double whammy. Oh, Hoiberg nearly got there. Odegaard, he finds Smith-Rowe. Vieira. Saka on the touch. He wants to skip past him. Does deliver in a decent ball. That's great defending. Smith Rowe once more. Oh, Arsenal pressuring now. Saka, another good ball in. Another good defending. Jorginho now. Come on, we got to steal it. We steal it here, we're in. Arsenal were just going, going, going. Rashford trying to stay with his man. Martinelli now. He gets it in there. Grimaldo clears it away. Ganacho. Bruno, and he's looking for Marcus Rashford. And he's found him. And that is a shocker. Ref says play on. Hoyland using the strength. will take it. No, he doesn't want to bring it back. Blimey, this is a mad game. I'll tell you what, FA Cup, this is, <laughs> this is exactly what it involves. Watch the line ball. That's a good pass. Martinelli, and that's how you do it. Get out of this shame. So there is a change. We have taken off Rashford. We are going to bring on Mr. Ahmad Diallo. Yes, he did it in real life. Can he do it today and win the FA Cup for us? That's what we're going for. I'm going to boot this as far as we can. See if we can put some pressure on. Because if Hoyland wins this header, oh, he nearly won the header. But yeah, would it be amazing if Ahmad scored the winner? Oh, ho, ho, ho. that would be ridiculous, to be honest. Kai Havertz has come on. Saka's actually been taken off. Nelson's been put on. Interesting change there from Arsenal. Here is Nelson. Oh, no, no. Beautiful. And that's what I love. Once again, this mod, it's just... The, honestly, the re I know we've been losing games. And you're saying, Ricky, you're making it harder for yourself. But you guys don't realize that I've been playing with a mod that is not the most responsive and like my players are actually doing technically what I ask you know so it's nice but we still need a goal all right Varane Kasunu oh please be careful we're not going that way because you can you can see the way they want us to go 
Here is uh, Dallo now. Ahmad, Mainu. Oh, Bruno's through them. It's a good challenge, though, isn't he? Not messing about with that one. Dallo. Kasunu finding Varan. No, no. I was going to say, hang on. Arsenal, they're starting to press a little bit more now. We really are. I'm trying to play like passes that split the defense. Kasunu. Is that going to be a good ball? No. Well, there's a big chance here for Arsenal. It is going to be Odegaard. Fires it in. Kai Havertz can get there. No. Come on. Get it out. Well done. Well, this is a chance here. Hoyland. And look at Ahmad. <laughs> Generally, that was like that was like the Liverpool counter. Ahmad was making the run. Except instead of Ganacho passing, it was Hoyland. That would have been hilarious. Here's Vieira. Havertz can't get there. We still have we, we can still win this, boys. We seriously can. Here comes Alejandro. Who's in the box? Look at the back post. Ahmad. Oh, it would have been all right, but it wasn't all right. Because it wasn't good enough. We're we really going to go into extra time here. It looks like we may be. Maynu. Unlucky. Nelson. Kai Havertz flicks it on. Vieira. Averts again. Well done, Alejandro Ganacho. And it looks like that's going to be the end of the match. Fergie time. No, it's Ten Hag time. We're going into extra time. Ah, madness. All right. One attempt we had all match against five. It's just one of those matches. We're going to have to make some changes here. So I will see you at the start of extra time. So Ten Hag's made one change for Manchester United. Grimaldo replaced by Lissandro Martinez. He's looking a little bit tired. So, you know, Martinez is not a left back, but he's got a left foot. So I'm sure he'll figure it out. So that's what we're going for here. There's, uh, oh, an early chance here for Ahmad Diallo. Lovely ball. Come on, Diego Dallo. Should have probably tried something different there. That's fine. Casemiro's missed the challenge. Is Kai Havertz? No. Varane thought he had the ball. Did a Michael Jackson move. Then he won it back. So credit to him. Fabio Vieira. He's going to keep it alive. It's Gabriel. It's just a mad game, this. Anyone can win this. I mean, they really can. I mean, do we want to bring on Skamaka? Not really, to be honest, just because I don't want to take off. Oh, Kai Havertz. That's comfortable. I don't want to take off Rasmus Hoyland. He's always going to have the legs compared to someone like... Uh, oh, Diallo, what's your man? Oh, I said, what's your man? And luckily, that's a poor pass. Arsenal still 61% possession. Shows you the name of the game there. Here is Odegaard. I mean, we're not winning the midfield. That's gone out the uh, that's gone out the window again. Averts. That's a great challenge from Casemiro. See, Casemiro is a worker. Oh, careful, Nelson. Careful, lads. Don't let Odegaard do the business. Timber looking for the back post. Varane gets it away. Trossard was there. Let's not give a penalty. Oh, this is too much. I can't handle it. These matches just, I mean, they don't, they, that's why I'm getting greyer by the day. The grey hairs. Timbo, he's going to lose it. He's going to lose it. Well, no, he isn't because he's faster than Ahmad. He's whipped that ball in. Martinez gets up well. Gamacho, Gamacho. That'll do. That's fine. Put it in the corner. Hoyland. Look at the switch. It's not a bad ball. Oh, you jammy plum. That was the chance. Jesus, watch the run. Nelson. No. No! Oh, you're having a laugh! He didn't even mean to do it! <laughs> That's all right. We still got time. Don't get too carried away. He didn't even mean that. He just got his face in the way of this. Who's meant to be marking him? It's a good ball in. It's a good ball. He doesn't, he doesn't even know anything about it, Jesus. He just hits him right into the face. Look at this. Doesn't know anything about this. Just hits him right in the old facety facety. Right, well, we've got to bring on the big gun, the Skamaka Maka. That's right. We're putting two up top. I'm going to take off Mainu because he's knackered and bring on Amrabat purely because A, he's on form. 
And B, he's a destroyer. Maybe that little bit of extra. I would have put Mount on. I know you're thinking, you need a goal, Ricky. What are you playing at bringing on Amrabat? But, you know, if he's going to be better at covering, then that's fine. We're also playing more of a diamond formation in the middle. So, yeah, we're going to... We're going to try that out. That's an absolute shocking challenge there from Jesus. Look at this. Straight through him, son. That's some error, not happy. All right, come on, lads. There's still time here. There's a lot of time. Dallo, we want to just whip it? Well, we have to whip it. That's beautiful. Go on, keep going. Lovely. Right, who's in there? Near post. Oh, come on. What a way to introduce yourself to the match. Skamaka with an emphatically taken header. Ladies and gentlemen. Woo! That is, a, that is a beautiful finish from the Italian. Game on. Look at this from Dallo, though. Lovely play. That's what Dallo would do in real life. Skips past him. Balls in. That header. <laughs> there is no better feeling when you score a goal off the underside of the crossbar. Of course, it would be better if we were winning this match. We're not, but it's 1-1. Right. <laughs> That's crazy. 15 minutes more to go. Strap yourself in, ladies and gents. We haven't finished here. Oh, blimey. All right. Here we go. So away we do go. Another 15 minutes to play. Is this going to go to penalties? Is it not? I have no idea. You don't get a single goal in 90 minutes, and then you get two goals in 15 minutes. Welcome to football. Well done, Namrabat. That's what I want to see from you, mate. Casemiro does win the header. Ahmad flicks it off. Casemiro once more. Martinez. Let's just boot that up the line because there is a player there, and his name's Bruno. Skamaka. Ahmad, lovely turn, and this is the chance. This is the chance. This really is a fantastic chance. Great play from Ahmad. Look at this turn. Just cut past him, and yeah, he just ran into him. All right, Bruno Fernandes. If this is the time to whip one out, mate, whip it out. It's going to be. Bruno Fernandes! Come on! And now it's our turn to celebrate. Ten Hag says yes, we are the greatest player of the team. It still hasn't finished. It still hasn't finished. What a free kick this is though. Right into the netting. Well, obviously into the net because it wouldn't have been a goal. Let's have a look at Bruno. Who cares where it went? Just look at that form. Hmm. So Man United 2, Arsenal 1. What an FA Cup we've had here. The Red Devils have turned this around. But there still is 10 minutes to spare. We're going literally now ultra defensive. And Ten Hag is preparing to possibly bring on a couple of extra subs here. Defensively to shut up shop. Amrabat. Dallow, Man United just launching it now. It's a wonderful pass. It's Rasmus. Keepers coming out. Oh, he makes the save with the tippity tip. Well, that was a chance to seal it. Rasmus again, he's absolutely demolished. And yeah, he'll be coming off. Don't worry about that. And we'll make those changes defensively. Uh, but yeah, by and dear, just take your time, mate. If uh, Arsenal aren't going to close you down, they're looking tired now. Have Arsenal run out of gas? Been a long, hard-fought game for them. They have dominated possession for most of this match. But now, they find themselves close to being eliminated. Bruno Fernandes looking for Ahmad. Five minutes. Oh, it's a loose pass. Ahmed Diallo was close. Kai Havertz. Watch the ball back towards him. It's going to be Varane coming across. Lovely play, Raphael. Not one of the turtles. Kasunu, let's be careful here. Okay, let's not be uh, ridiculous. And mm, nah. So the final substitution, and it's Harry Maguire. We're going to go for Harry over Schlitterbeck, just, just because. We're putting three at the back. Well, five at the back. We've got two wing back, two left back, right back, three centre backs, two DMFs. 
one centre mid and a partridge in a pear tree. That's what we're going for. But yeah, Rasmus, quality, mate. You did your job today. Of course, we haven't finished yet. Arsenal still have possibly a final chance here, but they've got to get the ball in. Kai Havertz, Nelson, get on him, please. No, no, no! Oh. And Gabriel Jesus with half an attempt, nothing more there. This is madness. Can you, uh, you guys pitch a sitting here for like 40 minutes playing this match? <laughs> trying, trying and trying to get through after being a goal down, we're into the final minute. Here's Martinez now. Just get it forward. Just pump it. That'll do. Casemiro is still going. One minute of stoppage time here. Here's Nelson. Ahmad. No, I didn't really need to dive there. Referee blows for full time. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Could you have got like more of a realistic match after having that Liverpool game? which was a quarter-final in the FA Cup. Yeah, we won 4-3. Insane. This was a 2-1 match, not quite as lively. But considering we were a goal down, I wasn't holding a huge amount of hope, but we kept pushing through. And there it is, four attempts to eight. Not a ton of chances at all, and we got out-possessed. But at the end of the day, we did what we had to Man of the match is Bruno. Schmackety, schmackety came on and had a, a, an instant impact. So that's why we bought him. Fantastic. All right, let's have a look at the other results. So elsewhere, Aston Villa. Extra time win there for them against Nottingham Forest. Man City beat Brentford, but Newcastle have spanked Tottenham by four goals to one. So, folks, that does mean that in the semi-final... We're going to take on Aston Villa and elsewhere it's Man City versus Newcastle. That's crazy. If we win and Man City win, that's basically real life. It could be Man City, Man United in the final. <laughs> that would be funny. All right. Fantastic. What a game. God blimey. <coughs> All right. Anyway, we will be back. We haven't finished there, folks, because in the next episode, we're taking on the Liverpool uh, as well as heading back to the UEFA Champions League. So uh, we've entered a crucial stage, and the next one's a key one. Um, but they're not the matter. Da, 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 da. Are you worried that the squad's consistency isn't good enough? Look, look, look. Okay, we are Manchester United. We're taking on Liverpool. It'll be a good game. We are going to play the one, the two, the three touch, and uh, we know we can win the title. No, we can't win the title. I don't know who told him that. What a load of nonsense. We're playing for top four even top five and trying to win the uh, the Champions League and the FA Cup. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next episode. I hope you guys did enjoy that. I mean, the Newcastle one was tough. Ah, bollocks. Hoyland's come out with an injury. Uh, so Marcus Rashford now is officially a dummy runner. Hmm, interesting. Let's try that out on him. Uh, Marcia, we've had an offer for. We've also had an offer for Shura Shure. <sighs> How long is Hoyland out for now? Not good. Two days. All right, that's nothing. Then he'll be back for... Um, oh, does that mean he's missing the next game? Oh, he's missing the match against Liverpool. Come on. Okay, well, Skamaka's on. Hmm. All right, well, we'll figure it out. Anyway, I will see you in the next one. Let me know your thoughts about, like, the formations and all that stuff. Uh, but, yeah, we'll be back. Liverpool, Club Rouge in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed it, and take care.